So on this video, I'm going to show and guide you on how you can install your own control panel and start hosting your websites in no time. So I assume you have a VPS or a virtual private server with no control panel installed. So you just bought one, a basic one with um, nothing in it. So let's get started. So the first thing we have to download is actually a software for you to connect to your uh, VPS through secure shell um, access or HSH. So let's uh, get the software. Let's um, open up Google. Now here we're going to search for PuTTY. P U T T Y. Download and hit enter. And we're going to go here. And here you can download the PuTTY exe executable file. I'm going to save this and put it in my desktop. So I'm going to double click this and run. I'm going to open it so I can copy this or drag this to my uh, computer folder okay I'm gonna close this and I'm gonna close this so this is what we have this is what party looks like so what you need to do is enter in your VPS IP address and the port is 22 and save it so let's just do that let me uh, I'm gonna copy this the IP address the IP address of your VPS. I'm going to put it here. I'm going to save it as VPS. Click Save. Now I'm going to click Load. Open and you will get this notice. Click Yes. And Here we go. This is, this is the login prompt of your virtual private server. So you should be able to log in as root. You have your root password, right? So I'm going to grab mine real quick. So as I always taught you that to put your password in a safe account, such as an email account, I'm going to log in here, VPS guide, and grab my VPS password real quick. Here it is. And make sure when you copy it, sometimes you will include a, a space, right? See? there's a space there so you, you don't want that space that space there so you want to copy the whole thing without any space I'm gonna close that and go back to the party so notice when I enter my password by right clicking on here I'm gonna right click see nothing happens because the password won't be shown and I'm gonna hit enter there we go we are now inside the VPS. Now, the first thing you have to do is to check if you have yum installed in your VPS. Now, what's a yum? Yum is an application for your VPS to be able to install packages and applications within the server itself. So, if your VPS doesn't come with yum, make sure you ask your VPS provider to install it for you. Sometimes um, they have a container with no yum installed so uh, this is what I got with no yum installed so I just ask my VPS provider to install it for me and within a few hours they have it installed for me. To, to check if you have yum installed just type where is or locate Okay, I'm gonna use where is okay. There, it said um, you are being yum. So we have yum, okay. So we're good. So if you don't have yum, go ask your provider to have yum installed on your VPS. Yum is what W U M. That's how it's spelled. Okay. Okay, let's uh, move forward now. We're gonna go to the um, virtual main website 